I feel good now. Um, you know, but that's a steady thing that'll come back, you know, pretty quick. But I feel, I feel good. Um, yeah, well, like I said, it just comes back with playing, you know, and running up and down, uh, you know, just kind of getting that win back, which with that comes with strength, so it should be fine. Um, very confident, you know, this, this team... We've been there before uh, without Steph for you know, pretty much that Houston series in the first round, I think it was, and then uh, some of that Portland series. So we've been there before, and just like last year, KD missed most of the first round, you know. Um, but I still feel very confident in us as a team and getting the job done. I think it helps a lot, you know. You know, our plan is to have two more months of basketball to play, you know. So, um, you know, just kind of having that week of not playing, uh, obviously it helps physically, but also mentally. Just not, you know, preparing for the everyday grind. Uh, and although you're trying to, you know, get back to 100% healthy. It's still just not the same as, you know, the adrenaline and intensity level and focus level of, you know, playing in a basketball game every night. Damon, what can you make up for the Bucs? Uh, obviously, it was the team that uh, broke uh, your streak last year. Uh, do you think that there is, uh, it's a team that is underperforming concerning, concerning the level of talent they have? I think they definitely got... How you doing? <laughs> I think they definitely got a, a ton of talent. Um, I mean, it's not up to me to decide whether they're underperforming, overperforming. I don't know what their goals are. I don't know what their expectations are. Um, you know, but I know that they're definitely a team that no one really wants to face in the first round of the playoffs. So uh, that's on them to decide whether they're under or overperforming. How about uh, your matchup with Giannis? Uh, I mean, I, you know, Giannis is a great player, you know, great young talent, uh, you know, a force to be reckoned with for years to come. Uh, he's one of those guys where you probably won't shut him down, but, you know, you just try to make him take shots that he's not as comfortable taking. Uh, you know, try to make things a little tougher on him, uh, just make him work for his baskets, you know. A lot of that is, you know, not turning the ball over and trying to keep him out of transition and always making him play in the crowd. But, you know, that's definitely not a one-man effort. That's a team effort in trying to stop him. When Steph was out in December, you guys were the best defensive team in basketball for that stretch. Steve talked about wanting to kind of get back that identity to us, but how much do you put that on yourself? Uh, you know, obviously I always want to be the leader on that side of the floor. Uh, you know, I got to bring it and, you know, make sure, you know, we're focused in on that side of the basketball. I think when our focus level is there, um, you know, we're locked in on that side. You know, we're just as good, if not better, than anybody, you know, as far as, you know, defense goes. So uh, I think it's, like I said, it's just a focus level and, you know, going in and, you know, really with a defensive mindset. Uh, I mean, well, I ice out the games anyway, you know, just knees and stuff for longevity. Um, but, you know, nobody's 100% healthy at this point in the season, if at any point during the season, except for the first day, even if you're 100% healthy then. So uh, that's just the nature of the game we play. Uh, you know, everybody's fighting through some type of nick or not. And, um, but we're paid to play basketball. We're paid to go out and try to contribute for our team. So that's what you try to do. Yeah, that was rough. Uh, it, was, you know, it was a different feeling for sure. Uh, you know, it's 
probably a little bit better to get hit where you don't want to get hit than where I was hit, but it happens. Uh, it is what it is. I feel good now, so that's all that matters. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it went down. So it's good. Why? Nah, it's pretty, it's pretty normal now. My elbow right there now. <laughs> there it go. Yeah. Nah, but it ain't as big as it was. Remember, it was like this. So it's pretty normal now. Uh, I don't know. I never got a drink. Some people, I guess, get a drink. I'm a soldier though, so mine drain itself. <laughs> How you get a fix? Me either. <laughs> if it ain't broke, don't fix it. <laughs> <laughs>